Hey, John's getting quite a few by hand, look. You know, there are too many over yeah. here. I got Hand picking, cross. Big white meat ones, too. Yeah. That's great. Pretty good, yeah. Like That's a little on me. Am I still alive? Oh, okay. Hey, you need them. There you go. Literally just grabbing them by hand. See? They're getting me by claw. Or they're grabbing him. Mitch loved this. Wish you were here, Mitch. Big beautiful tan one. Oh, I love those for live bait. Yeah, that's a good looking dad right there. Oh, yeah. Here's some nice looking dads. And they come out of uh, Lake Solano, I believe. Yes, that far. Really I've even put a lawn chair right here and kicked it with my feet in the water, just picking dads as they come by. Those are the days. We got to get up front with our big nets. We only got one net today. We just came by to check it out. And sure enough, it's happening. Oh yeah, Mitch. Wait till we get to the front seat. Oh. Can you see him? There for the taking. In the wall. The wall! The wall! slow, those crawdads are gone. They're moved like lightning. So. Hopefully John will come up with some nice crawdads. Looks like there's a stick in the net or something. Too quick, and maybe there's not a bunch up front. I don't know. I figured that. Uh, we usually use a square net, too, rectangular, two of them, and we do it tandemly together. So uh, there's a technique for this. Mitch knows about it. But the round net is not the best net for trying to scoop crawdads, especially in the cemented area. Two caught ends and a couple chubs. Alright. We did better hand picking, huh? Yeah. They weren't up there. Yeah. Well, they might have just opened it. Could have even been today. 
it takes uh, a little bit of heat for them to release that water. So um, three days of semi-hot weather, heat wave for the mail and all this out. So uh, maybe a few more days, there's be a whole bunch more. There's plenty of hand pick, but uh, we're on our way home. Get a little pump doing this kind of stuff though, it's almost addicting again. Been picking more across. Got quite a bit now, and John's been using the net and hand picking. So okay, let's see what John's got. Wow, it's doing pretty good. Yeah. A lot of uh, big ones. Right yeah, there. that's what we want, the white meat tail. So. Oh, it's pregnant stickleback too. Got to make sure we get those in there unharmed. Yeah, those go back, of course. Okay, let's get these crawdads in that bucket. Okay, we've removed the crawdad, so uh, that's what's Run left. The fish and little baby crawdads, which we don't need, so they're going back. We're right back here in the flow. There you go. You did pretty good. That was just a pit. More hand picking crawls. Big one. And you got some big boys there. Some big reds. That's better than the trap. Yeah. Exactly. Nice, yeah. nice. The Friday traps have not been doing so well. We might have to move them. That's how bad they're doing. But this hand picking turned out okay. How easy that. Okay, back into the water. I think we're done, huh, John? Yeah, that should do it. Yeah, so this was just a pit stop, so. Well, the yardigans did good. What will those yardigans get into next? I don't know. Always stumbling across up. Ain't that the truth? We'll be back with another something. Oh yeah.